When it's intentionally, you can just cut them off. That's yeah, easy. yeah. Lexi, girl, what time? Oh, let me see what time it is. Where she's at? It's like what? Three, in the three at night. Is it three in the morning there? Lady Lexi just got back from the club. Uh, see there, Lady Lexi. See there? <laughs> douche, 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 douche. Yeah. Well, I basically slept till almost midnight and then I woke up. It's three twenty a.m. over there. Yeah. Well, judging by the title, it. it make pretty much sense like someone who's like drowning you of all the energy so i was thinking like it okay do i know these people and of course a few came to mind and you know you know back in the days when i was a little bit younger um we would usually refer to silence <laughs> And, and so neither of us would say anything anymore. And then at some point it was like, okay, I'm going to hang up, bye. So nowadays, especially with that same person, um, I, I, I'm more upbeat, I'm, I'm positive by nature. And uh, what I've noticed is that when I try to be like, okay, well, good thing is you get this and that out of it. The other one still wants to be right, and mm -hmm. well, no, no, that's not true, and you know, and then I might just let it go for the sake of argument, like okay, let's keep it nice and, and, and have fun. Um, you know, at some point, just by just letting it go and and remaining positive myself, um, it usually gets pretty good, and there's no suctioning of energy anymore. So uh, how do, do I deal with it? Yeah, probably that is the answer. Probably that is the answer. And yeah, as for for the the the, the energy, it's it's literally like training myself every now and then. I'll tell you. I'll tell you in a minute, Mary. I'll tell you in a minute. Jose, what's so funny? Well, no, Mary. Mary is Mary is asking me. Um, how come almost all your vampires seem to be women? Oh, you talk about the displays. Um, I don't know. I, you know yeah, what? No. I agree, Mary. I noticed. The no, same no. It's a blimbo. That's a guy. Uh oh, Zan. Hold on, that's a guy. Hold on, hold on, hold on. That's a They're guy. They're coming for you, Zan. I know. That's a guy. That's a guy. Uh, and when I notice, I'm uh, losing my energy. So either I just say, "Okay, gotta go." Or sometimes I just withdraw my own cocoon and just let it happen. And then that way, no energy is being taken away from me. So, well, sometimes they don't know that they do it and it's not on purpose. Okay. But the thing is that we have to recognize it first that they're, you know, draining us from energy. And, and, and I literally learned through spirituality spirituality but you're right um, Lady Lexi. So by, you... by, by putting like a uh, spiral around me yeah. oh, oh when it's intentionally you can just cut them off That's yeah easy. yeah <laughs> i'm not gonna let them get to me you know <laughs> anyways that's that's my um that that it's so important to recognize if it happens to you uh, whether it's short term or long term, long term is maybe even harder to witness. Um, in both cases, I would say set your boundaries. Uh, like you said, no access to to you. So it could either be like blocking someone on the phone or saying no, I'm not going to see you. And talking to what uh, Jose said uh, before, or Jose, sorry if I say it wrong. Um, especially when it's fr friends and family we're talking about just be open and honest to them why you want to interact with them or why not or what your um, what what your set of rules is for them and if they can't agree with it then just protect yourself and run yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, so yesterday on my I Instagram live actually I talked about literally using using the light so I, sh I say to people like with, with your heart just open the hatchet over there and then like you're taking out this lantern of light 
and that little ball of light and you make it bigger and bigger until it consumes you and then wow. you make it even bigger until it's in the entire room and you protect everything around you and then when you feel good enough you take a little bit of that ball of light and you just <laughs> so <laughs> the other person i love it <laughs>